own Erin Michael. She's checking out the green scene in La Jolla, sipping on some great coffee. Good morning, Erin. Renee, now what better way to start your day than with a nice hot cup of coffee? But this is not just any coffee. This is a very unique coffee shop. We're live in Bird Rock this morning, and I want you to meet my friend Chuck Patton. He's the large and Good in morning. charge owner this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thanks for having now, when I said to everyone that I was going to do the green scene here in Bird Rock at a coffee shop, they looked at me like I was a little crazy, Chuck. <laughs> so why is your coffee shop green? Well, we're green for a couple different reasons. One is we only use organic and socially responsible coffee. So from farm to cup, we're trying to follow that green path. And then once you get here, we only use green uh, cups. So our hot cups are compostable, our cold cups are compostable, the cutlery we use is biodegradable and we recycle and so we just kind of make every effort possible to be green. Now can I bring my own cup if I want to you be extra eco-friendly? You certainly can and you'll get a discount if you do that. Oh awesome, so, what's yeah. better than that? Yeah. Now we couldn't help but notice Chuck, I have to ask you, you guys are a locally owned business, you're right, right. here from San Diego, right. you moved in across the street from a Starbucks. Well, what were you thinking Chuck? <laughs> well, what were someone, you thinking? Someone had to do it and uh, you know it was funny, right when we opened up people came in and said, did you know there's a Starbucks across the street? And um, we did, and we just felt that we had a totally different product to, to offer people. We had a totally different um, way of going about business. And like you said, we're locally owned and locally responsible. Um, a lot of our revenue goes back into the community, and we try and support the community as they're supporting us. And do you find that your customers appreciate that, and you have sort absolutely. of a different clientele than maybe absolutely. goes to Starbucks? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, there's, there's a group of people that are, they're always going to go to Starbucks no matter what. But, but our customers really appreciate what we're doing on the green side and on the socially responsible side. And they also appreciate the fact that we're kind of you know, a good um, community member, which is Now, neat. I know you've got to have some locals that come in every day and probably order the same thing you probably have it memorized. <laughs> our, uh, our director, Nick, I don't know if you know this, back at the station, and he says he likes his coffee like he likes his women. Oh, so really? I, I don't know what that means, <laughs> but, uh, but what are some of the favorite that. orders that come across your counter every day? Well, you know, I, we uh, really focus on a straight cup of coffee. So our, our coffee our coffee every day is, is different. We offer coffee today from, for example, from Panama and Brazil. And so we would like people to kind of experience the varietal characteristics of, of the countries that we're bringing in. Um, in addition to that, you know, of course, we get the lattes and we get, you know, the frappes and all that kind of stuff too. But, um, you know, we really do like to focus and I think our customers really like to focus on the straight coffee. And do they have, uh, you said you can get a different sort of taste experience every time you come in, Correct. right? Because you're constantly Correct. changing it. So are your customers Absolutely. experimental or do they stick they to the do. old standby? No, no, they do experiment quite a bit. And then they all develop different favorites, especially with the coffees. It's it's like, oh my gosh, the Brazil's on today. So they're really excited about that. Or, um, you know, whatever we have, if there's a new one on, they're excited to try it. So, yeah. Now, Chuck, tell me real quickly, am I going to pay any more for organic coffee? There is a, you are going to pay a little bit more, but I think if you look at our prices, they're in line with, um, with what everyone else is doing as far as price points. But the other thing that we do that not any other cafe does really in San Diego is the only milk we use is organic. So we only use organic milk for all of the lattes and cappuccinos. So of course there is a, a little bit of a price increase there, but it's, it's well in line. So you're paying a little price. extra, but But it's you're getting an organic product, you're getting um, a product that's socially responsible and you're supporting it. Chuck, thanks for having us in here this well, morning. We're going to meet some of your friends around here in Bird Rock right. that come here every morning. And Joe and Renee, I don't know if you know this, but we heard that Joe Bauer doesn't live far from here. And so, you know, my photographer Rolo and I, we thought we'd throw his name around a little, yeah. maybe get a free scone or something. And um, it turns out that didn't work so well. But Chuck told me that uh, Joe has an open tab here. So the next round, it's on you, my friend. Oh. No problem. Well, you know, down Bird Rock, they maybe they don't want to recognize me uh, like they They're should. They're not claiming you, Joe. They're not claiming you, but they will have a latte on you, Come my on. friend. I'm, I'm spinning around those roundabouts every day down there. <laughs> Come on. I will stop in because I want a socially responsible cup of coffee. But once I get coffee, it's very personal to me. Once I find a flavor I like, I want it there every time. So tell, tell the men in charge there that uh, that's uh, when I find it. It better be there every day. Or we'll I'll order one up for you, Joe. All right, good. Thank Otherwise, I'm going to so spin much, around Aaron. those roundabouts until I make We'll butter. put it on your tab. Awesome. Put it all on my tab. Listen, you know, it's all on me today. You throw Joe's right. name around, and it just costs you a little extra. That's all.